Hey, what's up, gang? Out here on the road, but I wanted to stop, take a break, and bring you a quick and easy Bible study for Genesis chapter 5. And my number one takeaway for today is that it's okay to skip chapters sometime, okay? And so the lesson here is really that when you come to a chapter that's either too difficult or you don't understand the context right away, for this particular study, it's okay to walk away from it and come back to it later. And we will come back to it later, uh, especially when we start moving into the story of Moses, when we move into the story of David, and specifically when we move into the story of Jesus. But for right now, a chapter full of a lineage that's outside of context because of the way that the Bible is structured is not really going to be ultimately helpful to you. So I wanted to make this video to encourage you that sometimes when you come to something that just doesn't make any sense stuck out of time, it's okay to skip it, continue reading, and then come back to it at another time, or maybe even look up some uh, surrounding information, some of the context on the internet uh, or in concordance or something like that. So not to say that Genesis chapter 5 isn't important because it very much is, but for the purposes of this study, it's okay okay to skip and move on to chapter six. Hope, uh, hope I was able to encourage you that sometimes it's okay to do things differently than the way you were probably taught as a kid. I think that's um, really one of the linchpins of how I've been able to grow is that sometimes you got to break the rules. All right, hope you guys dug it. Be sure to check me out over on Snapchat, BRY Chambers. Check me out over on brianchambers.com. Subscribe to the mail mailing list and subscribe to the YouTube channel here. Love you guys. We are stronger than I. See you tomorrow.